Tua Tungabailoa just got paid, and that is huge for the Miami Dolphins, and I'm here to break it all down. Before I hop into today's video, 25% off all Tua merch on the dolphinsite.com. That's these kind of shirts, hoodies, and canvases. Last for a week, it's automatically applied at checkout, but I'm gonna hop right into it. I think this is absolutely massive. I was actually about to make a video talking about that the Dolphins need to get this deal done ASAP because losing these critical training camp days can really have a big impact on a team, especially starting the season fast, which the Dolphins haven't had an issue with, but to go where the Dolphins want to go, which is winning the division, winning a playoff game, and then ultimately the Super Bowl, you have to build that continuity early and build off of that as the season continues. And if Tua continue to have his sit-in kind of situation, you impact the potential of the beginning of the season, potentially dropping games that you should have won otherwise. So I think it's important that the Dolphins got this deal done, and they did. Now your quarterback's happy, the rest of the team's happy. You can operate practice to the best of your ability. He absolutely went off in practice today and then proceeded to get paid. Obviously, he probably already knew he was going to get paid, but I think this is ultimately massive. And then a few hours later, Jordan Love gets paid, and he gets paid more, despite the fact that he only played one, basically half a season that was pretty good good now i'm not i'm not trying to say who's better or whatnot but i'm saying for the fact that two has played every single year and he's been a pro bowler he's been playing he led the league in passing last year and jordan love who's played way less has gotten paid more it just goes to show that the dolphins did a good job in this negotiation but it's also fair to two he got compensated fairly well uh, he's under contract for the next five seasons so the dolphins have their qb1 uh, I mean, it feels good to be a Dolphins fan too. When's the last time you've had this kind of conviction in a quarterback? It's been a minute. And uh, I ultimately would say he's the best quarterback in franchise history since Dan Marino, which big shoes to fill, but Tua has stepped up. He's a perfect scheme fit for this offense. Uh, you could say he's made by his weapons, but I really think once this offense continues to develop, once Tyreek Hill's gone, once I don't see Jalen Wild's got a lot of years left with the Miami Dolphins, but ultimately I think he's the perfect operator of this offense. That's why I feel so confident in the Dolphins paying him, and I think it's going to pay off long term, and hopefully we can build off this, win some playoff games, win some Super Bowls, and ultimately be very happy with this decision. But when you compare it to the rest of the market, usually each quarterback that gets paid resets the market, resets the market. He's paid less than Burrow, Herbert, love all of those guys trevor lawrence like the fact that we got this deal at such a good rate i think it just ultimately goes to show the good job done from chris greer brandon shore and the rest of the dolphins staff and now all that's to be worried about is football you continue to build off of this and i'm just extremely excited for this season and i think Tua is going to continue to develop and get better as he's shown year in and year out comment your thoughts down below are you happy with this deal and i'm happy this happened now too because now your windows the next two to three years before these big cap hits really start kicking in the perfect example of that is josh allen with the bills once he got paid they still were able to fill the very good roster for like two seasons but then this past year is when they those big cap hits started rolling in and they had to purge their roster and that ultimately is going to be what happens with the dolphins when you pay a quarterback this kind of money that is inevitable so hopefully the dolphins can really take advantage of this window with this extremely talented roster and hopefully win a super bowl comment your thoughts down below check out the dolphin side for that 25 percent off limited time deal and until next time fins up